first end blanked between USA and Switzerland in this must win for both teams. In the second end, fourth player Briar Herleman making the cool nose hit against four for her single. In the third end, USA would have the hammer. And uh, they were looking good for their deuce pretty much uh, throughout the whole end. And Corey Christensen making no mistake with her last shot to score the two. Perfect game plan so far for the American girls. In the fifth end, Switzerland looking at the double for two, but uh, will choose to play the intern draw. Perfect line on the draw, but comes out just a foot heavy, and uh, USA with a big steal of one to be two points up on the Swiss. And in the fifth end, a bit of the same story, looking at the double, but electing the simpler shot for one, but doesn't quite come off for them, rolls out, and uh, now USA really in control with a four shots to one lead after five. After half time, again the Swiss lying a few against Briar Herleman, needing the nose hit for the single. But history repeats itself, rolling out, and USA would steal another one with the top red. Five shots to one after six. In the seventh end, USA playing a great end forcing Briar Herleman to play the draw to the one foot for a single, but seemed to be losing a bit of confidence throughout the game. This draw turning up way heavy, a steal of two for USA, and he would lead the game a solid seven shots to one. Having scored one in the second end, it took a while for the Swiss to be up on the board again. A single here in the seventh end. Sorry, in the eighth end. And they would try and steal a few on the USA in the ninth. But uh, USA making a good job about clearing all the stones out. First real miss from Corey, and she rolls out, but steal one's not good enough for the Swiss. And they will shake hands after nine. So, Corey, coming into the last game of the round robin in a must-win situation, how hard is it to avoid looking at the other sheets and thinking about their win-loss uh, win record? <laughs> All we can do is really concentrate on what we have to do and win the game, and I think that's exactly what we did, is just start sharp and keep it going throughout the whole game. So. And now you've got a quick turnaround until the tiebreaker game. Mm -hmm. uh, what are you going to take from this game going into the next one? Um, I think we have a lot of good momentum going into our next game. And um, like I said, just starting sharp again and continuing on like we ended this last game. Perfect. Well, good luck. Thank and you. And congratulations. Thanks.